The shooting took place just hours before Rhode Island lawmakers and educators were scheduled to take up the issue of school safety. Local leaders are meeting at the state house right now to decide how best to prevent and prepare for these kinds of situations. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell joins us now live outside the state house. Susan, as you just mentioned, that hearing is still going on and senators tell me it couldn't be more timely. On Tuesday, a shooting scene unfolded on a college campus in Texas, and just over a month ago, 26 people, mostly young children, were shot to death at Sandy Hook Elementary School in Newtown, Connecticut. Now Rhode Island lawmakers are asking questions to find out if schools in the Ocean State are as safe as they can be. It's because of all these issues that we need to be aware of what plans are in place. In Rhode Island, we are in um, good shape. We already have been practicing lockdowns and we're very much aware of safety issues. So this is to make sure that everybody's together and we're talking about what is done and what needs to be done. On Tuesday afternoon, several people testified in front of the Senate Committee on Education, including Rhode Island Education Commissioner Deborah Gist. We have good practices in place and we feel confident about those practices, but anytime you have have an incident, it gives you a chance to take another look, do another check, make sure that you've done everything that you can, make improvements, make some adjustments, and that's what we're in the process of doing right now. Senator Gallo tells me it's too early to say whether any legislation will come out of today's hearing. Live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.